FarmBot is going to make gardening interesting for a lot of different people in a lot of different ways. It's a robot that gives you a level of control over your home garden that wouldn't be possible without the use of this technology. On top of the fact that, you know, it's very technological and it gives you uh, a new level of control over your gardening, it's what's called open source. So that means that it's not encumbered by any patents or any restrictive software like a lot of these Internet of Things uh, appliances that you see nowadays. FarmBot is completely hackable. It's completely customizable. We offer all the software source code, all the 3D models for everything online. And it lets gardeners who really love to garden uh, it gives them a customizable experience and control over their garden. And for other folks, it allows them to automate things that uh, they might think is tedious, like, uh, you know, checking your soil moisture every day or watering every, you know, eight hours if you live in a very dry climate. Premise what is NASA doing with this thing? Do you know? And, and why do you use it? NASA contacted us, oh boy, it must have been maybe five years ago now. and. They are working on a couple different things. You know, they're they're trying to grow. Uh, they have a program called Veg E, which is on the International Space Station, and they're growing salad greens on the space station for astronauts, so that they can eat vegetables when they're in space. And the eventual goal, though, aside from growing it on the International Space Station, they also have plans that they want to put a greenhouse on, you know, the moon. And eventually, when this is decades into the future uh, when they want to do a, a human mission to Mars, they are investigating, you know, what would it take to get automated equipment onto Mars that could, you know, sustain a greenhouse. You know, I'm too curious about this. Is your farm about right now on the space station? Unfortunately, it's not. So the, the, the machine that's on the uh, space station is called, uh, I believe it's called Veg E, and it's a, it's a cube kind of device. There are several farm bots at NASA, but they are not in space. They are inside of a laboratory there. And in, in doing their research for that project, they uh, I believe they own two farm bots right now. And the challenges that you face in a, in a microgravity environment are pretty amazing. So, you know, farm bot would not be ready out of the box to go into space. <laughs>